Axios media reporter Sarah Fisher told CNN on Tuesday that Fox News insiders have privately told her that they think they're going to lose the $1.6 billion lawsuit against Dominion voting systems. In particular, Fisher said that the newly released deposition by Fox News owner Rupert Murdoch is littered with damning evidence that Dominion's lawyers can successfully use to prove malice against the network. If you talk to folks, I have sources inside Fox News, they'll tell you that they think they're going to likely lose this case, she said. They might say that there was a newsworthiness in covering what Donald Trump was saying, but there's a clear difference in newsworthiness versus peddling and having the people who are peddling these lies on your show. Host Erica Hill then asked Fisher to backtrack and elaborate on the Fox News insiders who think they're going to lose the lawsuit. Related, Rick Wilson questions if Fox News viewers are asking what else network execs say about them off-camera. I am hearing that, she said. And I think that Rupert Murdoch's deposition, which was unsealed yesterday, concedes that. Fox News has publicly pushed back against Dominion's claims, however, and has accused the firm of cherry-picking quotes to make the network appear deceptive. There will be a lot of noise and confusion generated by Dominion and their opportunistic private equity owners, but the core of this case remains about freedom of the press and freedom of speech, which are fundamental rights afforded by the Constitution and protected by New York Times v. Sullivan, Fox said in an official statement.